Just like in most of the season and in the period behind us, the Atlanta Hawks play very inconsistently. In the last five games, the team has recorded three wins. In their last match, they faced the Portland Trail Blazers and recorded one more victory. The Atlanta Hawks had higher desires and ambitions than the position they currently occupy. It's obvious that this attempt to build a team around Trey Young and DeJounte Murray has not yielded the expected results. There has been much talk for quite some time about trading a large number of players, but that idea has been abandoned. Absolutely all of the Atlanta Hawks' problems stem from defense, which is one of the worst in the entire league. When the defense is so poor, then even a quite good offense like theirs cannot solve the problems. This will be a back-to-back -back game for the Atlanta Hawks, and it will undoubtedly be a challenging circumstance for the hosts. The Atlanta Hawks showed in the previous match what kind of performance they need to deliver to defeat the Boston Celtics. The Boston Celtics have practically held the top spot in the league since the beginning of the season and have hardly let it slip until now. In the last 10 games, the team has recorded nine wins, with their only defeat coming in the last match against this same opponent. When Drew Holiday and Chris Tapps Porzingis were brought in during the offseason, it was clear to everyone that the ambitions of the Boston Celtics were as high as they could be. So far, the team has shown truly excellent performances, looking powerful both defensively and offensively. They currently have the second best defense in the league and the most efficient offense in terms of offensive rating. When you add to all of that the fact that they are also the fourth best rebounding team in the league, it's no wonder they are convincingly in the league. Derek White is also a very important component of the team, acting as the connective tissue among teammates. Although they have practically secured home court advantage until the end of the playoffs, we believe that the Boston Celtics will be highly motivated in this duel. They will certainly want to avenge their loss to the Hawks from a few days ago. This will be the fourth matchup between these teams this season. The Boston Celtics won the first two, but then the Atlanta Hawks prevailed in the last one after a significant comeback absences and injuries. Trey Young will not be playing for the Atlanta Hawks. In the previous matches, the Boston Celtics have shown that they are the superior team. Despite their defeat in the last match, we believe they will be highly motivated to avenge this loss. Additionally, considering this will be a back-to-back -back game for the Atlanta Hawks, fatigue may play a factor. However, spread set seems to us to be too high, so we have decided to suggest that there will be more points scored in the match than the offered margin. Our prediction is over 224.5 points. Remember, yeah, I will be